Hey sportsmen, today we're in Frankfurt, Michigan. That's right, Benzie County. Two great stops. First, we're gonna visit with Captain Dave Rommel out on the big lake catching lake trout. And then, second half of the show, awesome bass fishing on Platte Lake. Stay tuned, this is gonna be an awesome show. Good morning folks, John Bergsme here with the Great Lakes Fisherman's Digest. We're here at beautiful Frankfurt, Michigan, near shore trolling. As you can see in the background, Fast Eddie's working his way to the back of the boat. We've been here for not five minutes, already got one on. Stay tuned. This is gonna be an awesome show. Near shore trolling, Frankfurt, Michigan, with Dave and Ellie Rommel from Tiny Bubbles Charters. Doubles. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is what it's like at Frankfurt, Michigan. It gets stupid. That's a beauty, Edward. Lift. <laughs> Davey will show that one off. Nice fish head. Now you got him, Al. He's hooked up, Al. <laughs> we don't even have time to take the fish off, Ellie. Fish? It is good fishing. Get him, Al. Well, I'll tell you what, the populations of the trout have been so good in the lake. It's been awesome. Slow it up, Eddie, and just drag him. We got another one on the, on the dip. I'm the deep diver. Here, here comes Davey. We'll show these fish to you, but doggone it, we got too many fish biting too quick. We got no rods in the water. That's the best way. <laughs> oh my goodness. You got it. No, you, you got, got this one. Here you go. <laughs> This is crazy fun. And the cool thing about this fishery, Dave, is you can do this because of how close to shore we are. You can do this in a lot of different weather conditions, basically other than a straight hard west wind. Yep, northwest would be rough in here, but, but really, yeah, I mean, pick your day, but you can come out here in just about any boat. Oh my Got goodness. I love this fishery. We've been coming up here since the since the Marys, Mary and Mary from uh, Tourism, started having us come up and fish, this has been a total education for me to how good this fishery is. You know, you hear about great fisheries. Until you come up here and experience this, you know, if you're a, a guy like you see Ellen in the background, she'll reel in as many fish today as anybody, but guy wanting to educate your kids, whether it's a young daughter or son or both in outdoor, lifestyle, Elle will tell you there's nothing she'd rather do than fish. Right, Elle? Or turkey hunt, which is it? That's a tough fishing. one. Fishing? Yep. And it's only because Dad spends more time, but the turkey hunting's not far behind, is it, Elle? No, that's pretty fun, too. No, I'm just trying to, this fish is definitely not disappointing, exactly. Yeah, we. It hasn't been too many times where we haven't had doubles today. Oh, <coughs> nice fish. Did I get you, Dave? Not yet. That's, I think that's the biggest one so far. Oh, yeah. It's a nice fish. Oh, 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 oh look at that. <laughs> this is a good fish. Oh, boy. One more time down, John. I'm going to try. He's diving. Uh oh. I'm gonna hold him away from the engine here. Yep, might have to go over. 
Jeez, look at that thing. Thing is, here we go. He likes that prop lift. Wow. Big goby eater. This might be a releaser. Oh boy. Oh my goodness. He's not damaged. Awesome fish. Frankfurt, Michigan, baby. The Fisherman's Digest is brought to you by Strike King Lures, tie one on. Lose, feel the difference. And Wave Pro, best ride on the water. Remember, when he starts rolling, be real gentle. Keep him coming, keep him coming. Got him. <laughs> That's a chubby one. Wow. That's a nice fish. Uh -oh. We'll show you this thing. Right now. <laughs> Think he wanted that bait? He trounced it. That is an awesome, awesome lake trout from here out of Frankfurt. Compliments of Miss Ellie Rommel. What we're going to show you here on this little tip is even though we're on Lake Michigan trolling for lakers, we're still structure fishing. We're bumping up against this tip, and this is where having on our Garmin having a great uh, ch mapping chip, I'll zoom in and show you these specific depth contour lines. You can see 34, 35, or 36 foot. We're trying to run that 36, 36 line around the tip of this point. And by doing that, we've identified that there's some really good fish sitting from 30 to 50 feet of water. So by just bumping into the structure and not just aimlessly trolling around in open water, but actually using structure as a magnet, it's been awesome. As you can see, four fish in the first, it can't be more than 20 minutes and only because it took us 20 minutes to reel four fish in. Fishing's fantastic when you use your Garmin and its mapping chip capabilities to put fish in the boat. And we have another one on. This is so much fun. Hey, if you haven't gone and near shore fished for these Lakers here in the Frankfurt region, you gotta call Tiny Bubbles, you gotta get out with Dave. He can put you on this fast action. I mean, guys, it is 8, 10 in the morning. This is fish number eight and nine. And uh, this early season bite, I think, is probably the most underutilized bite. Everyone wants to come in the summer, and that's great. We love you to come in the summer. But man, you want some fast action. The month of May up here in Frankfurt for these Eater Lake trout is Run. awesome. Triple. Okay. Stay on them, Chasey, because this one's a small one. We'll show it to you right here on the surface. Ooh. Awesome eater fish, but this is gonna be this is gonna be the board clearing festival here. I'll open the live well so you can flip it right in. Jeez, that's a nice one there. Edward's fighting one, Ellie's fighting one. We've got Ellie catching a fish, we got Ed reeling in a fish, we got me netting a fish, all of this in the back of a 22 foot boat. Now Dave will grab this fish. Look at all of the room we got back here. Oh, that's a nice one. I got another one right here. Look at that move space. This boat is so deep, I'm leaning right up against there. If you're looking for a Great Lakes boat, for lake trout, walleye, salmon fishing, multi-species fishing anywhere in the Great Lakes region, Crestliner's 2250 Authority paired with a Merc 300 Verado. Awesome, awesome lift your rod tip. That's three fish in about five minutes. John, I'm gonna go ahead and fire We're this one back. We're gonna release that. Go yep. ahead, Chase. Let Chase get locked yeah. on you. All set. And Dave, that's one of the cool things about the shallow water fishery is you can release these trolling fish, correct? That's right. If you're not pulling them up from you know, 60, 70, 80 feet, no. they do pretty well. Exactly. The, the trout aren't huge natural reproducers, 
but uh, they do reproduce a little bit on their own. So yeah. it's good to get those big ones back. And it's just like a, you know, your beef or your venison or anything. The, exactly. the smaller, younger ones are definitely better. The Fisherman's Digest is brought to you by Offshore Tackle, leaders in trolling technology. Trax Tech, the ultimate fishing system. And Garmin. back this way a little bit well I'm just just Let trying to get it wants. in to show people the fun that you can have when you're bass fishing <laughs> feel like I'm in Canada right now <laughs> hey welcome to the show everybody we're here up at Platte Lake big Platte Lake in yeah. Benzie County awesome largemouth awesome smallmouth and first fish of the morning is a awesome northern pike that we'll try to get in the boat and show you you know, that's not even a big one for this lake, is it? No, it's it's a good one, but whoa, oh, he's uh, he's out. He's already unhooked, and we're going to have a, have a wrestling match here. That's a good one. That's a good fish right there. Platte Lake, Benzie County. Awesome start to the day. <laughs> Mikey, a you're a bass a fisherman hey, usually, we'll but today we're that guiding tugs. for northerns. Yeah. Let's anything let this that girl go. <laughs> Ah, that's a nice fish, yeah. That's a really, <laughs> really nice fish. That was fun. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> Back to bass fishing. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. That's a nice one. That's a real nice one. You know, that's the cool thing about the Platte Lake system is that there is so many different ways, Mike, you can fish this, right? Yeah, buddy. I mean, you got sand flats, you got weeds in with the sand, you got some trees. You got big, uh, fat smallmouth. You got big, fat, sm big, fat, Benzie County smallmouth. We fished on Crystal, we fished on the Big Lake, and let me tell you, that might Fine. show that one off. Beautiful. Yeah. He's got that little crooked in his mouth, so we're going to cut the line out of there and uh, let him go without uh, hurting him. See you later, buddy. Awesome. Oh, that's a big one. I don't Another one want... that ate it on the way down. Oh. <laughs> I am so pumped right now. <laughs> Get this one. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh man, did you goodness. see that jump? He's big. <laughs> he is big. That Maybe jump was just nice. Stay Move down, buddy. Stay down. The... Yeah, I know. Stay down. <laughs> That's the uh, thing about these guys. you got to be easy on them and yeah. not rush it in here and tear the hook out of their mouth. I'm telling you, man, if you want fun, Benzie County, Platte Lake today, Crystal Lake, you've got Platte Bay, mm -hmm. you've got the, the, the Lake Michigan shoreline, which is just a mecca for lake trout and king salmon. And have you seen the big kings they've been catching? Yeah, they're almost 30, 30 pounders. pounders. Yeah. But today, they tried I'm not stabbing. Oh, today, Mikey, <laughs> show that beast. That's a dandy there. Oh. <laughs> the colors are just spectacular on these oh. fish, too. And healthy? Yeah. Crazy. Fat, wide. I mean, they are, uh, they are dandy fish. And just slow tossing it, just a green pumpkin, you know? 
Oh, and he came free. Beautiful, beautiful. We'll show that off one more time. There you go, buddy. Awesome. Yeah. That's a good one, John. Awesome, bud. <laughs> we got to keep catching them like that. That's right. Oh. We will. It's early. Yeah. See you later, buddy. The Fisherman's Digest is brought to you by Crestliner, forged with strength, defined by durability. He grabbed the back. There he is. Got it? Yep. Nice. He grabbed the back of it. And that right there is why. Oh, look rock at bass. the size of this <laughs> rock bass. Wow, we're going to show you this because it was crazy. <laughs> You want world-class rock bass, buddy. <laughs> that is a world-class rock bass right there. That's a big one. I don't normally show off a rock bass, but that right there is a big <laughs> rock bass. I thought it was a smallmouth coming after me. We'll let him go. Breathe on it. Oh, big one. Big smallmouth. Big smallie? Yeah. Does that mean you need me? Yeah, I need you. <laughs> I need you, John. I need you, buddy. Holy moly. As Mike fights this fish, let me just tell you, Benzie County's Platte Lake is worth every minute of your time. This is a... He's held enough big fish, I'm going to hold them up. <laughs> <laughs> you got it, buddy. Oh my, I don't want to scoop. This is why the superior paint job of a Crestliner boat is worth it. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if little green pumpkins work. In the Benzie County sun, Mike is putting us on fish. Boom! Look at that train wreck. That's beautiful. Mikey, that is an awesome, awesome fish. Hey guys, let's talk just a little bit about what we used today to catch these bass on Platte Lake. Now, custom lose speed stick, it's always my go-to action. Medium, six foot long, mock crush reel, six pound braid. Now people think six pound braid, I mean diameter. Might be 14 or 18 pound test, but I like to have a light braid when I'm fishing shallow water bass. Why? So I can get that bait far away. I can do a lot of long casting. Super clean water on Platte Lake, so a fluorocarbon two to three foot liter is important. All day was soaking the zeros. Now, this is an Ocho in one of my favorite colors, this little garter snake color, but today it was the zero in green pumpkin with a little gold and a little purple fleck. Now, let me show you how I rigged that bait. I got one rigged up right here, and the best way we found was with a little weighted jig head. Now, mine was weedless and Mike's was not, but I was throwing a 16th, he was throwing an 8th, and as I look back on the day, he caught more fish than me, I kind of feel it's because as I watched him, he was fishing just a bit quicker than me. He was able with that little bit heavier, even though it was only three, four, five foot of water, that little bit heavier jig, that 8th ounce jig, he was able to pop that. He was being a little more aggressive with his lift, which I think created a lot more lift fall scenarios. And when you're soaking, a zero or an ocho, you want to pay attention to little details. The lift fall and the being a little more aggressive put more fish in the boat today. But let me tell you what, day in and day out, spring, summer, winter, you name it, the zero, the ocho, and a little hook can put huge fish in your boat. Yep. Sure oh my. <laughs> that looks like a better fish, John says. Okay, I'll get the net. <laughs> Wow.
That's a slab. <laughs> that is a slab. That thing's round. Look at that. <laughs> Just another little day on Platte Lake in Benzie County. You all come up here. What you think? <laughs> That is a hog. <laughs> Those are just dumb fish. That is just a... Hey guys, an awesome day here. Awesome. Awesome. It's just <laughs> been crazy. It started a wee bit slow, but then we have put the hurt, the hurt on these fish here. For this sure. has been awesome. Yep. Quality of fish, middle of the summer, a buddy, you got to come here to Benzie County. You got to check out Big Platte Lake. And while you're at it, check out the whole area. Crystal Lake, same thing. Yep. Awesome smallmouth, yep. inland fish. lake trout, and the outer shores you saw earlier in the show with Dave Rommel right out there for some really cool lake trout early season. Hey, thanks for joining us today on the Fisherman's Digest. We'll see you again, and the next time we got Big Mikey in the boat, we're gonna be pounding fish. See you next week. <laughs> Closed captioning brought to you by WavePro. Best ride on the water online at waveproshock.com.